Lovely hearty, it's a very good afternoon to you. It's just me, Scotty McClure, and I thought we'd have a quick pop-up just to see how everybody is today, how you're keeping during lockdown, is all well with you, that sort of thing. And in general, just looking after not just one nation, but every single nation watching TikTok right now. So welcome, 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 I say, to Scotty McClure live streaming for a Sunday afternoon. Hi there, says Joe. Hi, Joe. Lovely to have you with us. Nathan's just joined us, Dinky Doo, and a very warm welcome to Scotty McClue live streaming on TikTok just for you. Now, I've got some fabulous, fabulous news for you. We're linked to the YouTube channel now. That was um, something that had to be checked out, and um, I don't think it was going to the right place. So we're now linked to Scotty McClue's YouTube channel. So if you're on there, follow me, please, and then come and join us. Mr. McClue, Dinky Doo, mate, says Paul. Dinky Doo, Paul. Lovely to have you with us. Hi there, definitely, dinky do, and a very, very warm welcome from me, Scotty McClue, this Sunday afternoon. Say mongooses. I don't think it is mongooses. Tony Cregan, thank you so much for the TikToks there. Guys, thank you for all your lovely gifts, and please follow, follow, follow me. Very, very important. Scotty, good evening, dinky do, MMZ. When you say good evening, where are you? Are you sure it's not mongoose? So there we are now. Now, Maddie, you need to go and seriously grow up, right? That's been tried on me for 36 years, and we're never, ever, ever interested in that level. This is a big, big thing. This isn't the usual junk that you're used to watching. This is quality, quality, quality all the way, so we've no time for any silly wee trolls. Hello, hello, this is DMPN, dinky do tell ten to tell ten to tell ten, says Lana. Absolutely. Absolutely, Lana. Very, very important that we do. Guys, we're now linked to YouTube on the TikTok, so if you press the little square beside my profile, it'll take you directly to the YouTube channel and also to the um, Instagram channel. Did you see the France-Scotland rugby game? Um, I haven't watched it as yet, Taylor, but I've no doubt it was excellent. What are you talking about? We're talking about everything on here. So get yourself sorted out, stay with us, and catch up with all the latest in quality. Hello, 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 Scotty. Are we well? Oh, Karim, we are outstandingly well. Lovely to hear from you. And uh, have you been looking at houses? Do you have mods, Scotty? No, we just uh, explained to the trolls that they're not welcome and that their behavior is unacceptable and they usually just move on to some other junk that's more suited to their very, very low IQ. So there we are. Hey, is this Melon? Hey, Melon. Lovely to have you with us. And Dinky Do. Welcome, 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 I say. Are you Santa? Yes, I am Santa. And I've got a good bit of time in my hands now. I don't really need to start working seriously until about October. I bought a house two doors away from my current flat. Fantastic, Kareem. Excellent. What do you think of Mr. Salmon starting his own party? I think it's going to be very... Very, very interesting. Well done, Mr. Salmon. I would have uh, liked to have seen him invited to be the President of Scotland. Her Majesty the Queen will always be the head of state, but, you know, the, the President of Scotland would have been quite nice. But uh, we'll see what happens. Scotty, where is your accent from? It's amazing, dinky-doo. Bugs, it's just me. It's not even really an accent. It's just the way I speak. Have I been good? Oh, XO, you have been excellent. Excellent. See what I just did there? Did you like that? So there we are. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I am Jack. Scotty, I'm an SNP member and also now an ALBA member. Why not, Kareem? I, uh, can you be a member of lots of political parties? Perhaps we should all join the lot and see what's going on. Uh, the Queen's a load of old nonsense. Absolutely wrong, 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 wrong. Wrong, 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 madhouse. You obviously don't know what you're talking about. So there we are. Uh, fantastic. Hello, Scott. You're going to get a happy 22nd birthday to my mate Norman Dillon. He's a big fan of the stream. So absolutely no problem at all. You sound like the grandpa 
that stays at the sea in Peppa Pig. Wow! What if I was? How amazing would that be? Guys, have you all followed me, please? We're terribly short of followers. We've been three weeks doing this, and we've only got, I think, five and a half thousand followers. And we've got thousands and thousands and thousands of viewers. So I feel if everybody who views follows, then we can build something very, very special. So there we are. Madhouse, there we are, Say, asks me if I'm a queen. No, no, no. There's only one queen, and that's Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth. So there you are. And I would actually be a king, you see, because I'm male. Yes, that's how it works. That shows you how little you know about it. Five donkey, you need to go on a serious think to yourself. You don't have any mates, and they're certainly not called that. So there you are. So you need to grow up. Go and watch some other junk that's more commensurate with your tiny IQ of one. There we are. Alex Salmond is the next first minister, says Aquil. Do you think so, Aquil? Do you think the new Alba party will be more of a help or a hindrance to Scottish independence? Well, having another Scottish independence party is going to always be a help to Scottish independence. You see, think about it. Tell ten to tell ten to tell ten. If I was running the Tories, I would remove the word unionist from their uh, their mandate in Scotland. That's holding them up. And if I was uh, running the Labour Party, I would say to Westminster, I'm sorry, guys, but we're Scottish Labour and we're pro-independence. Otherwise, we're going to just stay in the wilderness for the rest of our puff. You know, so stuff like that. Uh, who have we got here? 65 seat parliament majority, second vote, Alba or Greens. There we are. Who else have we got here? Yes, yes, indeed, Re. Uh, the anti, what's your view on anti lockdown protesters? I think it's shocking. We're either all in lockdown or we're not. If we're in lockdown, then anybody that's out of lockdown is breaking the law and they have to pay the price. Nobody should be out protesting, demonstrating, anything like that in your house. Lockdown, avoiding the spread of COVID, end of. All right, no bending the rules, breaking the rules. Na, 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 na. No wonder the police have to wade in, the poor souls. Hello, I hope you're having a lovely Sunday, mum of three sons. I am having a fabulous Sunday because I'm live on TikTok talking to you. So there we are. What could be better? The Tories have no chance in Scotland. Decade, I think you're a, you're a bit harsh on these poor souls there. You know what I mean? I don't know anyone in Scotland who votes Tory. Um, no, there will be there'll be a good one or two. I'll have to work out which it is. So there we are. <laughs> Why are Scots so angry? They're not angry at all. There's not even a scintilla of anger in the Scots. They're a little bit upset because they've been robbed blind for 313 years, but I don't think they're angry about it. They're just sad. Uh, that it, it had to happen that way. So there we are. Dinky do. Now then, have you had your vaccine yet? I'm a bit too young, but I'll no doubt be getting on the list. So there we are. Now, who have we got here? Uh, local blacksmiths just bought a new dog. As soon as they got it home, it made a bolt for the door. I love that. That's fabulous. Guys, if you've just joined us, you're watching Scotty McClure, the world's top broadcaster, the first lord of the internet. Can you follow me, please? Click the little square beside my profile and you'll see my YouTube channel. Subscribe and watch the YouTubes. So there we are. Did you see Ronaldo last night? And uh, No, I, I don't know him. He may well have been playing football. Um, I'm a Brit, but please don't hold me against me. I love Scotland. Can't wait to expose it. Well, a Brit just means we're all Brits because we just stay on a landmass called Britain. 
But there's no country called Britain, so you'll be a Scot or an English um, or a Welsh or a Northern Irish or an Irish. Scots rely on English money. Well, we don't rely on it. The English Westminster relies on Scottish money. That's the way you've had your head stuffed with nonsense. What currency are you going to use? Anything we like could use sterling, could use pound Scots, uh, like Ireland used of the Pund, the Pund, there we are, the Bank of England was started by Scott, it was indeed, Chris, anything good, Scots, everything that's been invented, that's big stuff, Scots, so there you go, nice accent, the Scots ran the British Empire, that's why they did so desperate to keep Scotland for a decade, of course. If only everyone was as educated as Scotty, says Susan Smith. Susan Smith, you're very, very kind to me. But uh, what a lovely thing to say. And as educated as you. These things work both ways, you know. The shops here in London don't like your money. Well, they don't understand it, TikTok world famous. That's their problem. Because English education is very poor compared to Scottish education. Very second rate. But, you know, England relies on Scottish oil or on Scottish everything. There we are. I bring some back every time and they won't have any of it. Uh, so there we are. What, the English money or the Scottish money? Guys, can everybody follow me, please? And news flash, very exciting news. My TikTok is now linked to my YouTube channel. So you can just press TikTok. You get it there. Where did you get your hat from? Hogs of Fife. When the oil runs out, Scotland will go capitating. No, Scotland's not reliant on the oil. Scotland has two economies, an offshore economy and an onshore economy. The onshore economy, the economy is very, very wealthy and buoyant. But it can't get working because all of our income goes to Westminster. So there you are. So it's like somebody saying to you, what do you earn a year? And you're going 10 grand and they go, could you lend us a tenner? You say, no, no, no. I give all of my 10 grand to my mum. So there we are. It's a bit like that. So you won't have anything. Scotty, you'll be watching the match tonight. So there we are. I don't uh, follow football. I'm English born, but my Scottish heritage via my great grandmother. Well, you see, you have all that wonderful background there. It's a lovely thing. I mean, I adore England and I love the English people, but I'm not very impressed with Westminster taking Scotland's income. So there you are. Scotland should be spending it itself. Mrs. Thatcher sucked the life out of Scotland. There, Brian says, stop the TV license. Well, you have to pay it legally at the moment. So there we are. Tommy in Glasgow always got the better of you. Madhouse. Tommy in Glasgow never, ever, 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 ever got the better of Scotty McClure. There you are, because he wasn't as smart as me. Capiche? All right, there we go. Now then, <laughs> who else have we got here? Ah, yes, Cadence joined us. What's your pronouns? XO, you never, ever, ever ask anybody their pronouns. That's shocking. We are miles ahead of that. That's passe. This is an all-inclusive TikTok. We don't need to know anyone's pronouns. Everybody's the same on here, you see. They were, hello, hello. Uh, there we are. Sorry. No, not at all, XO. I'm just telling you, we are ahead on you. Scotty McClue's always been ahead of his time. So there you are. Absolutely. Um, follow us, please, guys. We need every follower. Tommy Glass was smarter. You can learn a lot from him. I think I taught him almost everything he knows, Madhouse. So there you go. Taught him the lot. Well said. Scotty McClue, dinky do. Follow me, everybody. I need followers, followers, followers. Followers, 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 all the time. Love your voice, man. Marty, thank you. You're very kind. I would imagine you have an outstanding. Can you use jazz hands? So there we are, jazz hands. Yes, yes, I think uh, you can wave to people, but I think an, uh, an elbow bump is the other one. Of course, that does mean contact. Following me, please. And guys, remember, you can go straight to Scotty's YouTube channel as of last night. Edinburgh is full of English. Well, I would hope so. Scotland has been depopulated through social injustice and hopefully will now be repopulated through social 
justice. Do you see the karma in that? How fabulous is that, everybody? Dinky dear, I say. Mikey's just joined us. Amanda's joined us. Jippy's joined us. Dinky doo Caden's joined us. Guys, follow me, follow me, follow me, please. What do you think of single parents nowadays? Well, they'd be better with two, wouldn't they? Let's have it straight. How many subscribers do you have on your YouTube channel? And, uh, oh, a good, a good old number there, Susan. I could do with one more, though, if you're uh, in the mood to. Football team, says Marxist. You're a football team Marxist? The Marxist football team. Wow. I like the Scots. They all sound aggressive. No offense. No, 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 no. They're just having a wee chat. People say that about Northern Ireland as well. It's because we're very honest and very direct. I've only met one bad Scotsman, and that was a guy that uh, took money off me in a business. Uh, so there we are, just one in all my fabulous life. One bad person. Who's spamming me here? Caden, what are you spamming? I think we'll get rid of you, actually, because that's a big real no-no. Right, Caden's going, guys, because he's been spamming, okay? Can we all shout bye bye kitten? Bye bye kitten. Bye bye son. There we are. Excellent stuff. We don't like being spammed. Thank you. And there we are. We'll just uh, go through that. Bye, Jaden. Yeah, he's gone, Susan. Can't even hear you now. He's gone to uh, watch some junk somewhere in the dark web. Uh, do you support England in the World Cup? Uh, in 1966, I'm not really a footballer, so I, you know, most people support me, you know, so I, I don't really support things, they support me. Um, that's a silly question to ask on here, Matilda. What are you thinking? You've got to remember we're all inclusive here. So there's no point in asking, do you support LGBT? Do you support black lives? Do you support this? Um, what's your pronoun? There's no point in asking any of that stuff because we're all inclusive. Nobody's different on here. Can you see? You don't need a passport to watch Scotty Malclou's TikTok Live. Scott McLean, thank you, dude. How are you? Have you a moderator, sweetheart? I haven't, sweetheart, no. Uh, my brother's a big fan. I'm very pleased to hear it eat. So there were hi, Scotty. I got my jab on Friday. Slept all Saturday. Feel better today. Did you feel a bit funny, Mark? So there we are. Is Glasgow still a drugs den? Um, Glasgow, I don't think, has ever been a drugs den. Although I believe there are two, one or two people have been found to have taken drugs as they have in every other town and city. Scotty, you look like a good dancer. Oh, I'm a Highland dancer. Definitely. Get a wee whiskey. Scott, you know I don't drink. There was Brian with his Irish flag saying, hello, how are you today? How are you doing today? Is this Thomas? Thomas, fantastic. Lovely to have you on. Moderators could help block the spammers. Mum, we don't bother about them. They don't matter. These are Poor lost souls. They see something absolutely brilliant. They're used to, when it's something new, saying, can we actually go on and start destroying this and interrupting it? Answer, no, you can't. So I wouldn't even bother about them, you know. They're a wee bit like midges. Javeri Pet Scotty, until a fortnight ago, three weeks ago, I had a beautiful little black Labrador. You'll see him on TikTok. Look at the TikTok videos, Susan. Just scroll down to you see a wee black dog and then have a wee look at that. They're only about 15 seconds or a minute. There we are. Uh, fantastic. Steve Jams, I will do that. There we are. Patch is in Barlini prison, right? Have they let you text Scotty McClue from the Bar L? A Highland dancer, Scotty, a chance of dancer. There we are. Well, you have to take a chance. I have a black lab too. There's old Lord Wreath, Susan. Can you see him behind me there in the picture? Gorgeous guy. There we are. Scotty, send the summer sun up here in Falkirk. It's summertime. It's always sunny in Falkirk. In fact, have you not got California out there? Yes, absolutely. And you've got the big park at Falkirk as well. 
Um, I understand the higher road approach, but they can sometimes get in the way of conversing only for a nanosecond, Susan, and then, boo, they're binned. They're kicked into touch. <laughs> Fantastic. You've got that beautiful big park up at Falkirk. I set up the radio station for Stirling and Falkirk. Have respect for Scotty um, or do one. No stupid questions or spamming. Quite right, Steve James Jones. Uh, yes, almost as gorgeous as you, Scotty. Susan, you'll say such lovely, lovely things. Stop asking Scotty the same thing over and over again, so Steve. If he wants to answer, he will. All oh, the spammers go. Spamming, um, inappropriate handles, asking the same questions, uh, stuff that they're used to doing, not realizing this is different. This is the most advanced form of live streaming you can ever have. What do you think about graffiti around Bear's Den? I'm surprised there's any graffiti in Bear's Den. Is any of it spelt properly? You know, I would have thought that Bear's Den people could communicate without graffiti. So there we are. It's Kilmarnock. It's never sunny and it's always sunny in Kilmarnock. Get your pie. Uh, cats are better than dogs, no offence. Of course there's no offence, Marxist. If you're a cat person and you don't understand dogs, then absolutely, you know, do you mean better at what? Better at catching mice? Better at grooming? Better at purring? What are cats better at than dogs? I, California, but you're not answering it. Sergeant, we have answered it. What were you asking? What's your favourite track? Oh, I think uh, the track that goes up through Mugduk and over to Mugduk Castle. Fantastic. I love you. Hey, hey. I wasn't trying to annoy you. I'm trying to support. No, Mum of Three, you're absolutely fine. Don't you worry about that. I'm surprised there's even a spray can in Bear's Den. Yes, most of the cars in Bear's Den will have been hand-painted by a coach builder. I would think, I don't, I don't think they would even know what a spray can is. Most of them will use roll-on deodorants, you see. You've just got to watch your ball doesn't jam. Guys, can everybody follow me, please? Cats are better at being a great pet. Well, what do you mean being, what's a great pet, Marxist? Do you mean cats can bark better than dogs? Do you mean they eat more or less than dogs? Do you think they're better at uh, giving you a paw? Do you think they're better at giving you a kiss on the nose? Um, I mean, in what way are cats better? Are they better at going for a walk on the lead? Uh, I don't know. There we go. What age are you, says Sergeant? I'm of an indeterminate age, Sergeant, because you see, I'm a time traveler. So, uh, you know, it's very, very difficult to know. There we go. Cats are independent and selfish. I have two cats and a Leonberger dog. Fantastic. Can you give my football team a shout out? So there we are. Josh, yes. A shout for Josh's football team. So there we go. Scotty, um, and he's asking, I don't know, Stephen, I don't know what you're talking about there. What are your pronouns? Remember, you never ask anybody's pronouns, Grace. We're very advanced on here. We're way, way beyond any of that. We don't need to label our people because we're all equal on here, you see. So you're very old-fashioned asking that, Grace. Do you wear hats uh, or just the odd cap? Yes, absolutely. Now, who have we got here? You're the best, says Lego Legend. Lego Legend, you're very, very kind. Very nice of you to ask. Guys, how long have I been on here? Does anyone know? Respect, respect, Grace. Absolute respect you. Absolutely good for you. So there we are. You understand, you see. Very, very clever. Thoughts of still game? Well, I mean, people think Scotty McClue may even have been the inspiration for still game. Stop Brexit. Absolutely. We should do, we should rejoin the EU. Hello from air. What's the best plant? to look after. I think probably the old Kelvin diesel generating plant. That's a, that's a great thing, or a gardener generating plant. See you, Jimmy. See you. Uh, there we go. Now, who have we got? Uh, can you play plugged in? Um, 
No, I don't actually, because I'm too far away from the wall. Uh, can we talk about politics? You can, Marxist. Do you know anything about politics? So there you are. Most Marxists just have one philosophy and don't really understand politics. They're just sheepishly following the master, old Carl. Uh, what's your favorite food? Oh, I think anything edible. A bonsai tree, Scotty. Well, it is certainly a super thing, you know. But uh, I don't wish to. I don't wish to make it light or small. You know what I mean? Who's your favourite still game character? I love them all. Love them all. Love Navid. Love Isa. Love Bobby at the Clansman. Love Jack and Victor. You know, I love. Uh, I love, who's the other wonderful one with the bonnet uh, that uh, gets left off the bus? God save the Queen and the UK, Scotland, England, Northern Ireland and Wales. I think you're a bit late for the UK, but remember the Queen is very much the Scottish Queen. So there you are. Are you rich? I am the richest man in the world. I just don't have any money. There we are. So absolutely. Um, no, Tamsin, you mustn't assume everybody's like yourself. What do you watch on TV? I watch uh, Scotty McClue on YouTube. And what you'd be best to do is go, Alexa, play Scotty McClue on YouTube. And uh, you'll see all the Scotty McClue stuff. She'll go getting that for you. There we are. Boris is going on a Scottish tour of togetherness. <laughs> well, good luck with that. <laughs> Most people are isolating. Uh, what do you think of the police and crime bill? Well, very, very interesting, Marxist. What do you think of it? So there we are. I am not the one who is the inquisitor here. Well, I am the inquisitor. You give the answers. You're rich in knowledge, correct. Scotland will vote to remain if they know what's right. Well, Remain in the EU. They did vote 62% or 63%. Are you a gamer? If so, what's your favorite game? My favorite game would be Monopoly. I like that. Are you famous? I am very famous. Well, a couple of billion people will have heard of me. Is that famous? I don't know. I need to go. I'll come back later. You make sure you do, Lego the Legend. There we are. Guys, can we share the live video, please? Share, share, share it to share. So there we are. And uh, who have we got here? Do we need more polls? Polls or polis? There we are. We always need more polis. That's famous. I think so, Harry. Um, and not so much famous as just well-known across the world. Everybody knows Scotty McClure. I think it's a restriction on human rights. Which ones? George Strait or Johnny Cash? Love, love, love. Anything to do with it? Johnny Cash, outstanding. <laughs> My gran used to make soup with a ham shank. Absolutely. Did your gran do the smoked beef? Uh, their best TikTok ever, this one here. <laughs> People coming in don't realize you're actually a celebrity. I don't think they do, but I don't want to sort of bore them with that. It's like I've no time for these people that phone up when they're famous and say to the butcher or something, well, you'll know who this is. You know, I have no time for that. So when I'm phoning somebody, I say, I don't know if the name will ring a bell with you, Scotty McClure. And it gives them a chance to say, it, it doesn't know. I'm sorry, Mr. McClure. Or, oh, ah, of course. So there you go. That sort of stuff. Kareem, it's not Saturday. Well, I think Kareem will know that. Clotty dumplings. It's actually clutty. C L double O T T I E T T I E Clutty Dumplings T I E I think uh, double O one T Red White and Blue What does it mean to you Sing out loud song and so it is proud Red White and Blue uh, means France really doesn't it As soon as you say Red White and Blue everybody goes France. Da -da -da -de 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 Hi, Englishman. Hello, Daniel. Where are you from? Qu'est-ce que c'est? There we are, right. Qu'est-ce que vous disiez, Ray? So, Karim, didn't you know? Uh, 
You'll get a piece of anybody's house. I would hope so, skin bob. Just a wee chap at the door and sorry to bother you. Scotty McClue, I wondered if I could get a wee copy of tea. So there we are. I like a good ham shank on a Sunday, says John Douglas. Yes, but try the smoked beef, John. Do you know, absolutely. Very nice as well. And of course, the cauliflower and white sauce. You can't beat it. Haggers, tatties and turnips. I like your hat, says Hario. Hario, thank you. So there we are. Very, very much appreciated. Guys, can you follow me, please? And thank you for all your wonderful gifts. But very important, you follow, follow, follow. If you haven't followed Scotty McClue, you haven't lived. Get following. There we are. And uh, Jesus loves you. Yes, he does. This I know. For the Bible tells me so. You should be done for high treason in the United Kingdom. Kingdom. Well, the United Kingdom won't last because Brexiteers should be done for high treason. What do you think of potted hoch? Makes a lovely, lovely soup potted head. Uh, so there you are. Who's the handsome young man in the painting behind you? Oh, that's my Labrador, Lord Wreath. Isn't he beautiful? There we are. Any CDs for sale? Well, they're not for sale, but they are. They are there. You know, quite an extensive library. Uh, most of it's Scottish music, mainly Jimmy Shand. <laughs> there we are. We'll just get rid of this rubbish. That's fine. Right, okay. Sorry about that, guys. Just a dumpling heat pretending that they are official. So there we go. They've got potted heat sandwiches. Scotty, your predication of elections, you never, ever predicate elections. Otherwise, there'd be no point in having them. If I could tell you what the result was going to be, uh, any Alexander brothers? Yes, we do. Yes, the wee China pig and all that stuff. Nobody's child. Heartbreaking. Lovely. Tom and Jack. Fantastic. Outstanding people. What are your pronouns, Miss Skinny? You never, ever, ever, ever ask pronouns on here, Miss Skinny. We are way, way, way ahead of that. This is the most inclusive TikTok in the world. So you never, ever need to ask. We don't need pronouns. We don't need passports. We don't need anything on here. We are inclusive. Any Jesse Ray tracks over the sea, all sorts of stuff. You can't beat Jamie Shan, the Laird of Machti. Och, der Machti. There we are. Now, what have we got here? Was Ronaldo's goal over the line? Well, I would think any goal is over the line. Otherwise, it wouldn't be a goal. But I didn't see that one. Are you from Ireland? Everybody is from Ireland, from originally the African Rift Valley in East Africa near Kenya, and then Ireland. You sound like a pirate. Well, Harry-o, 15 men in a dead man's chest. Yo-ho-ho, -ho, and a bottle of rum. Um, long live the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland. Nice thought, Terry Barnett, but it's just not going to happen. It's had its day. And uh, the Scots have been ripped off enough for one 313-year lifetime. And I think they think, let's go, lollipop. Fantastic. Do you speak Scottish Gaelic? Kamaraha u hachamachi. Falchi, falchi, kida mili falchi maha. I guess, uh, tick-tock, I guess, scotchach makluach. You have a nice day. You too free. No, it's not part. It's not Scotland. Love being part of it. Um, no, they don't, you see. That's the problem. They don't like being ripped off. Some people, the simpletons do. They go, oh, I don't mind paying my tax to Westminster and having nothing done in Main Street. You know, that sort of idea. But I think people are starting to wake up. Does Scotland own its oil? Well, of course, if it's coming out of Scotland, then uh, Scotland will be doing the licensing. You and your SNP are a load of bullies, the only ones who want to. Terry Bennett, when have you ever, ever seen any bullying? I think you're getting mixed up with English nationalism. Scottish nationalism is a gentle left of centre philosophy, caring about people. So there you are. What do you think of politics? Well, I don't know anything about the Myla because I'm apolitical. 
So there we are. So there, have a wee look at that. Now, what have we got here? There's your telling them that the entire of Scotland voted SNP. Take your sentence and look at that. So there were fantastic. Seth Armstrong used to love Seth Armstrong. I remember when I bought one of my hats at a lovely outfitters in the main street in uh, Ilkley, just at the base of Ilkley Moor. So I was an Ilkley Moor with hat, not bat hat. Ilkley Moor bat hat. And I uh, went into this little pub, <coughs> and a guy came and said, Hey, it's Jack Sogden. <laughs> uh, the SMB don't care about anyone unless they have the same views. Well, I think you might find that any political party is less interested in people who have opposing views to them. I'm doing homework, says Harriers. Good, Harriers. Bye. Get that homework done. Top man. That's what it's all about. There we go. I have many friends living in Scotland who want to stay part of the UK. Yes, you might have one or two, but remember there's five million in Scotland, and at the moment it's on about 60%. So there you are. So work that out. That's 500,000 plus six. That's three million want to leave. So I'm afraid your friends might have to just go with the flow. You! I'm Scottish, says Millie. Good for you, Millie. Jack, you don't ask questions like that on here. We are way ahead of the game. This is the most inclusive live stream anywhere in the internet. Thank you, do Fantastic TikTok. Top, top, top streamer. Uh, now, follow me, guys, and remember to tap on my profile, the little square, and go to the Scotty McClue YouTube channel and subscribe. And there's 1,264 videos for you. Egg, says Richard. Have you got some on your face, Richard? So there we are. What have we got here? There's Stuart joining us. Dinky doo. Now, let me just put you in the picture here, guys, if I may. If I may. Right. I've got this for you. There's the YouTube channel, but you don't need to worry about the link. It says 1,200 videos because this was last week. 1,260, okay? And all you need to do is click on the little square on my profile on TikTok. They said it was a once-in-a-lifetime vote. No, they didn't, Terry. There was a mention as a throwaway line once in a generation. It's not written into anything. And um, that's the generation. So they were, we're talking seven years. How's less than 10 years, once in a lifetime? It doesn't matter, Terry. None of that matters. It wasn't said. Because then we didn't have Brexit. Now we've got Brexit. The goalposts has moved. The goalposts have moved. I've completed your YouTube. John Douglas, you're a top man. How's less than 10 years? It doesn't matter, Terry. Brexit has damaged Britain, broken it up. Yes? So the people that voted for Brexit are the separatists. Do you see? There you go now. Did you watch the boxing last night? What, in the street? Or? Um, I'm going to university next year. I'm so excited person. So you should be. You will love every second of it. It's hard work but you will adore it, and you can see the results behind me there, so you stick in. Good afternoon, what's happening with Nicola? A lot of fuss, there's always fuss. Yes, people just absolutely adore our Scottish government. You're breaking up the UK. No, Terry, I'm not breaking up the UK. If you voted to leave the EU, the second you did that, you broke up the UK. So there we are. So uh, in actual fact, Westminster are the separatists. What's your opinion on a united Ireland? I don't have an opinion, Brian, because I'd like to talk to the Irish people and see what they want to do, and to the Northern Irish people. So there are, because they are the people that actually matter, because they have to live with it. And we never, ever, ever want to see a day when Irish people uh, fight Irish people. Uh, there we are. 
Thatcher stamped on the Treaty of the Crowns. There's that. No, 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 no. The Treaty of the Crowns. Uh, you know, we're keeping the Queen if we ever have an independent Scotland or an independent Scotland won't happen. Can you see that? Why do you keep ignoring me, says Oliver? I don't know, Oliver. Is it something you've said? The EU have killed their own people, bad men. No, Terry, you don't have to talk nonsense. It's our EU. We built it up over 50 years of peace and fantastic prosperity. Why are you bad-mouthing yourself? You are the EU or were until the big mistake of a year ago. So there you are. Your views on the Elgin marbles, very shiny. Um, I get the Treaty of Union got messed with the poll tax. No, no, the Treaty of Union was wrong in the first place. It's always been um, very, very heavily flawed because it was uh, put through by jiggery pokery. The peace argument has nothing to do with the EU. Of course it is, five donkeys now ask. Yes, all the countries working together, Germany, our dear friends and allies, were our biggest business partners. We controlled the market, 30% of it. Hello, sir. Do you think the Stone of Destiny is the real one? Well, it depends. The one that they were crowning the kings at Schoon. Remember, a lot of Scottish kings, you had different kingdoms in Scotland. So a lot of Scottish kings were crowned at Donad in Argyll, at Kilmartin, just uh, north of Loch Kilpit. By leaving, we've been able to get the jabs out. Even you must think that's a good reason. Well, the jabs, you know, they'll all go out anyway. Do you know what I mean? We're only talking a few weeks, but Terry, it's our EU. If you're slagging the EU, you're slagging the UK, who made a mistake a year ago. We're now in the hands of a handful of hooray Henrys, working, uh, working people like you from the back. What do you know about Australia, sir? Uh, well, I can remember, um, you know, when a friend of mine was looking at moving to Australia and they said to him, do you have a criminal record? And he said, I didn't think you needed one. Uh, so there we go. Oddly teasing. I don't know enough about Australia, but I've heard wonderful things. I have a lot of friends in Australia and I've been told that I would go down very, very well on late night radio in Australia. So you tell me what you think. I'm proud of voted leave. Well, you should be deeply ashamed of it because you say we are out of the mess. You've created the mess. You've also created economic annihilation and you have created the political fragmentation of the United Kingdom. So if you're proud of that, then maybe you need to see somebody. Uh, Germany have killed their own people saying the jab's so bad. Terry? Again, nonsense. What you need to do, Terry, is stop writing until you think, I need to say something true, because there's not a jot or scintilla of truth in any of your posts there. Where to buy your flat caps from, Scotty? Hogs of Fife, this one. Fantastic. There we are. We rely on Europe for a lot of our food. In actual fact, Biha, we rely on Europe for 75% of our food and for 50% of our medicine. You see? So there's so much. Guys, can you all follow me, please? It's so important. Also remember that as of last night, we're now directly linked to Scotty McClure's YouTube channel on TikTok. So if you press the little square then you'll see the YouTube channel and there's 1,264 videos for you and you can look at all the wonderful lives from TikTok. I don't understand a single word. Now, Bill, I understand that. The Scots are very, very, very clever people and uh, unless you're up to speed, you've not got a hope of following this. But take your time, watch, listen, and learn. There you are. So what you're saying was there was never a pandemic, says Uriel. Quite Uriel. The EU just took our money, mate. No, they didn't niche, mate. Right? We begged and begged and begged to join the EU. We got knocked back. 
Well, we begged to join the common market. We got knocked back. Winston Churchill's dearest wish in 1946 was to have a United States of Europe with the UK at its heart. So the Brexiteers will have broken Winston Churchill's heart. It's just as well he's not around to see the mess they've made of the country. There we are. And the lives of all the people who fought for a peaceful United Europe. And we had 50 years of peace and prosperity from it until the Brexiteers broke and betrayed Britain. I was hanging out of the office early until somebody... Oh dear. I studied political science. There's two sides to this argument, and it's up to the people. There's always two sides to the argument. What you say about Australia? We love it, orangutan lover. We love Melbourne. We love Perth. We love Sydney, New South Wales, Adelaide. There you are. We say fair dinkum to you, Cobber. What's the difference with me wanting to leave the EU and you wanting to leave the UK? Well, huge difference. There's no comparison. The EU gives. Westminster takes. Are you with it? That's the difference. So there you are. Would you stay with a giver or a taker? You have a think about it. There we are. How are you, my good man? Where dink you do? Now we've got next to no money from the export by leaving. We've beggared ourselves. Economic annihilation. Uh, they'll try and blame some of it on COVID, but of course, 200 billion of it is Brexit. And we've got nothing to show for it. What if Scotland ends up leaving the UK and eventually later on the UK decided to rejoin the EU? Well, Scotland would be already in the EU as a separate state. So there you go. But I think that the UK should try and rejoin ASAP. Scotty, what football team do you support? So many of them. Oh, dozens and dozens of football teams I support. Such a, a long list. We start with Aberdeen and we go down to Plymouth Argyle. You know, that sort of thing. Now then, nice to meet you. My name's Gabby. My ancestors were from the Isle of Lewis. Well, so were Donald Trump's. Donald Trump's mother came from Lewis, I think. You were a yo, sir. There we are. Norman says up the Tories. I haven't seen that for a while, Norman. Yes, absolutely. Can everybody follow us, please, guys? We're very, very short of followers. Oh, when did I ask? Uh, I don't know. When did you ask, Steps? More used to listen to your show all the time when I was we. CK, that is fantastic news. Can everybody follow me, please? We have thousands and thousands of viewers and only a few thousand followers. Yes, after we've done a live, you know, a few thousand have seen it, but only a few hundred have followed. Get following. That should be up at 50,000 followers by now. So please follow, follow, and also watch the YouTube channel and subscribe. You might not agree with me, but my facts are truth. Terry Bennett, you haven't given any facts. You just don't like it, so shoot it down. No, you haven't given any facts, Terry. As soon as you give a fact, I'll acknowledge it as a fact. So there we are. That's your problem. You're telling whoppers. You've got a very vivid imagination because you live under the big toadstool at the bottom of Dingley Dell. I feel there'll be a political war coming soon with Alba and the up-and-coming Unionist Party. I don't know, Ryan. I don't think there's much of a an appetite for Unionist parties in Scotland. I think the Tories should remove the word Unionist from uh, their title because that's holding them back. Scotty, how many goals will be scored tonight? Afghanistan, if I knew that, Nobody would watch the match. The television company wouldn't like me. Don't suppose you have a spare 3,000 you can send me. I need it to help save me. I don't be JBJE. I got hit by a fraudster in business uh, about uh, 12 years ago and it lost all my money. Otherwise, you'd have been welcome to it. Uh, so there we are. Who have we got here? 
Terry says, if you don't want a debate, block me or get this platform where debate can happen. Terry, we're delighted to have you debate, but you need to say something sensible. There's not a jot or scintilla of truth. You need to start telling the truth. Once you give us a fact, we'll debate with you. We wanted to join the common market, not the EU. Well, of course, but it changed stuff evolves. It metamorphoses. There we are. <sighs> now then, Danad was before the kingdom moved to Skun. Well, Danad would be about maybe 900. Kenneth MacAlpin was crowned at Danad, and he was the king of Dalriada or Dalriada. Yes, you see, in all these kingdoms, times change, Scotty. They do niche, do they not just? And uh, after Brexit, wow, it's bye-bye uh, UK. Uh, we're still European, we'll trade with Europe, relax everyone. Well, we'll always be European because that is our continent. The UK is too cool for silly EU. Nothing silly about the EU and uh, the UK. What makes the EU, what's cool about economic annihilation and the breakup of your your product? So there we are. The best of British, well, that just means people that live in the land mass. To speak any Gaelic, Kamraha u hachimachi ben ko ashin. Oh, sho ben ha farchi farchi ki de mile farchi. So there we are. Sanji is asking, are you a Jew? There we are. Uh, interesting question. Uh, we did not have 50 years of peace with a lot of wars. Especially the EU that did not have. Terry, no wars at all in the EU. Very, very, very cordial relations until we decided to leave. Absolutely no wars. Nothing to do with the EU. There might have been wars to do with domestic politics. Nothing to do with the EU. Again, wrong, 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 wrong. Wrong, 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 wrong. Do you see what I mean? You're making these sweeping statements that are just rubbish. There we are. What's your opinion on whales? I think they're wonderful creatures. Wonderful creatures. Uh, it does worry me if they get stranded. So there we go. Now then, Keyshawn, you might just go and join some other junk where your IQ of one will do better. There we go. He's gone. Okay, who else have we got? Do you live in Asia or China? No, I live in Europe. Europe. But we send love to Asia and China. There we are. The EU left us to fight for the Falklands. No help. Well, that's domestic politics, Terry. It's nothing to do with the EU. See, we're talking about British sovereignty. Britain has always retained its sovereign sovereignty, as has every other country in the EU. So saying we'll get our country back was just made up to stuff your head with nonsense. Yes, there you go. So the EU, you know, we didn't have, I mean, people didn't want, did you want uh, a single European army? Would you back Winston Churchill? There you are. Do tell us. There we are. You've got a bubble. Yes, you've got a bubble. Leaving the EU was the best thing we've ever done. Absolutely, boo too. You can't beat poverty and economic annihilation and breaking up the UK. So there we are. So if you think that was the best thing, then you're an interesting, interesting one. I can say, watch the pronouns, Emily. We never, ever, ever ask anybody the pronouns on here. We're way, way, way beyond all that. Spain will never let Scotland join the EU. Why not? Give me one reason. Why not? Now, who have we got here? Sorry, just getting rid of an idiot. There we go. He's gone. Right. Who have we got here? Hello from Glasgow. So there we are. Scotland doesn't meet the EU requirements. In what way, Oliver? Do tell. We will uh, benefit from your wisdom. <laughs> yeah, says Seabroth. The dawn, says Derek. Absolutely. So you're a Cambridge and an Oxford man. Wonderful. And you're saying hi to the Dons. This is what Americans think we are. There we are. I told him that. He just started saying he was an idiot. 
told me, what did you tell me, Terry, that uh, has got me thinking otherwise? Leaving the EU was probably the best thing to happen financially in the long term. Well, there's no evidence to back that up, Darren. So if you want to just make sweeping statements with absolutely no basis to them, you know, I mean, what, what makes you think that? We've now got to try and catch up on everything we'd built up over 50 years of peace and prosperity. So there's absolutely no gain in leaving the EU at all. I'm moving to Edinburgh. Any suggestions, my king? Yes, Lily. Make sure you've got plenty of money for a flat. <laughs> Can everybody follow me, please? Follow, follow, follow. Are you from Texas? Yes, I'm a friend of the Yellow Rose. Uh, do you think we'd have survived the pandemic if we went on our own? Um, you no, know, I think there's been a lot of mistakes made without going into too much of that. Uh, I love this one, says Terry. Scottish Tories, your only hope for a better Scotland. Wow, right. So you think when we get the Scottish Tories in, Scotland will be a much better place. How interesting, Terry. What do you base that on? Is it the fact that the Tories have got such a huge majority? Lucid Sage of 53 views. Isn't it fabulous? It's actually 59 at the moment. And that turns into thousands. Well over half a million people have seen me. What makes you so great? I suppose, Sarah, it's just 36 years of communicating with the public. Um, I mean, uh, you know, it's very kind of you to call me great, you know, but I think that I'm just very, very well known. So there we are. Who have we got here? Can you shout out to my boy, Ben? He's come out today to his parents. So are you his dad? Uh, whereabouts in Scotland are we? I don't know. Have we a map? Uh, let's get looking. So there we are. Um, you're telling whoppers, Terry. Yes, absolutely. So share your knowledge. I'm sharing my knowledge. I like your hat, says Kenzie. Thank you, Kenzie. Just popped in to spread love and support and likes. Have a good day, Ricky J. We love your style. Thank you for that. Uh, are you knitted? I was knitted. Yes, you're quite right. I think my grandmother dropped a couple of stitches, though. Uh, so there we are. He's just a Scotsman. Uh, Brexit means exit. Yes, it does. It means exit for Scotland from the UK, I think. Happening, says Frigg. You watching Scotland tonight? Always watching Scotland. There we are. Everybody follow me, please, guys. <coughs> Hi, darling. God bless you. Marilyn from the Philippines. We love the Philippines. And we send you love and blessings. Most interesting fact, you know, about the Spartans. They were uh, very, very good shields. They made a very good targe, the Spartans. So there we are. They were a bit thin on the ground. They were a wee bit Spartan. Top of the morning to you, lad. Dinky do. Let Scotland be independent now, says Reptile. Uh, there's going to be a financial crash. Crypto, gold and silver will be the new currency. Do you think so, Susan? Well, it won't be the first financial crash we've had. We've lived with austerity to get the bankers their money back for their incompetence. Old ladies selling their, their wedding rings and stuff to get the gold back. Poor souls to pay their electricity bill. Shocking. Scotland Independent would die. Well, it didn't die in the thousands of years. It wasn't um, attached to the Union. Uh, and the Union's really just been a badly organized blip. So there we are. It's not bye-bye. UK will stay forever and a day. Terry, the UK's probably gone. Brexit broke it up. And you voted to break up the UK. So you have betrayed your country. Tot, tot, totity, tot. There we go, dinky do. Got my night shift, I have to go. Do you like custard creams? Ah, at last an important topic. Now, I love custard creams, adore them. But are we a bit tempted with the bull bongs as well? So there we go.
EU and Scotland is the future. RIP to the UK, says Brian. Fit like the day Scotty says Skuzak. Dinky do everybody. Guys, follow me, please. Follow, follow, follow. And remember, we're now linked to the YouTube channel. So if you click the little, little square beside my profile on TikTok, you will see the link live there to the YouTube channel and to Instagram. This is very, 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 very big, this stream. So come and join us and set your notifications as soon as you see Scotty McClue pop up. Remember, if you miss a moment of McClue, you miss a moment of life. There we are. So real wealth is land or solid gold. No, in actual fact, real wealth is life. The only true wealth is life. They're fit like the day, Scotty. Fools your doors, fine. Are you chaffing a war? There we are, dinky do. Scotty, you are my king. I thank you, sir. You act like you're a big start. I've never seen you on BBC One or on ITV, the main channels. Well then, Terry, you obviously haven't watched any television. If you go to the YouTube channel, you'll see me both on ITV and on the BBC. So again, Terry, you're telling us a whopper. There we are. Your ignorance is not fact. Scotty, what's your dream? My dream is for every single one of you to love the TikTok lives. That's my dream. My dream is to inform, educate, and entertain. There we are. Now, here's a sergeant asking me if I like a cheap wine. I don't drink alcohol, sergeant, so no would have to be the answer. There we are. Uh, now, who have we got here? Scotland gives the Westminster lot over 68 billion a year. We get around 30 billion back. Yeah, I think it could be as near as 75 billion we give. Now, you imagine if you live in Scotland, in Glasgow, Edinburgh, Paisley, Kilmarnock, Stirling, Falkirk, you know, if you're in Easter House, if you're in the Raploch, uh, you know, if you're in uh, Nidre or Rydre or uh, all that sort of stuff in Scotland, would you benefit from Scotland having another £75 billion pounds in the till? Think about that. Ask yourself that. Do an Irish accent, says guys. Well, I can't generalise. Is it north or south you want me to do? So there we are, because the south is nice and soft. Lovely to have you with us, Scotty. Thank you for coming. There we are. The north is a little bit harder, like that. You know what I mean, wee man? Uh, whereabouts in Scotland are you? I'm from Glasgow. I'm from Glasgow too, you sir. I'm from Ireland, but I agree with the Scottish man. I thank you, Anthony, and love to the Emerald Isle. We love every blade of grass in it. Scotty, you're so cool. Look a lily. I like you uh, asking that. Thank you. Scotty, do you even have a job? You're on this 24-7. Yes, I have a very, very big responsible job. I just don't make a lot of it. There we are. And uh, I, uh, I do this as well. So there you are. Very, very busy man. So there we are. Now then. Uh, what's your opinion on dance hall music, Scotty? Well, I loved Henry Hall and his dance band. Put that into your search engine and you'll get some real dance music. And I also love Jimmy Shand. He was great for dance music as well. The Kilt is My Delight was a good program. Heather Mixture was another one. The White Heather Club. Scotty, you're a famous star. Uh, oh, sorry. Do you have a famous star that you've met where you were starstruck? Well, Rory, I don't actually get starstruck because what I've been very humbled by, even more humble than usual, because I have three main titles. One is the world's top broadcaster. The other is the first lord of the internet. And the third one is the world's most humble man. And uh, <clears throat> I love all these titles. I very much appreciate them. And what really amazes me is when somebody very, very famous 
comes and says to me, Scotty, I'm delighted to meet you. I'm a big fan. We used to listen all the time when you were on. And that is very, very humbling, especially when you think of some of the people that see it. Oh, somebody tells me, I'll tell you who's a big fan of yours, Scotty. No. Do you support the UK? Well, no, of course I support the UK, but sadly it's going to break up because of Brexit. So there you go. Now, uh, what have we got here? Did you like the old Doctor Who? The Doctor Who what? Oh, no, sorry, Doctor Who. Yes, uh, William Hartnell. He was great. So there we are. Uh, what have we got here? Cambers Lang, the halfway. The Hoover. Guys, have you all followed me? Follow, follow, follow uh, as soon as you possibly can. So there you go. Joining the EU was just a way to move cheap labour and hassle-free. Who gained? Because it wasn't us. It was us, Big Wall. If you remember Scotland, before we joined the EU, what a shambles compared with now. So there we go. So we need to be growing forward all the time. So they are put it this way, no country that's ever walked away has ever wanted to come back. Well, why would you? You're gorgeous. <laughs> so there we go. Do you like Ireland, Anthony? I love, 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 love Ireland. There we are. Get right down to the ring of Kerry. What do you think of hate speech? I've never done any. I wouldn't know. Uh, so there we Oh, the hate speech bill. I don't know. I'll need to have a look at it. Scotty, uh, this guy keeps asking. <laughs> Can you do an ad voice? No, Ronnie, I can't do an ad voice. Connie, just no. Do you like Still Game? I enjoy watching Still Game. Uh, Celtic or Rangers, says Roots. What I would do, my best advice to you, Roots, is go and see them both play and then make up your mind. And, you you know, it's not cast in stone. You can be a Rangers supporter one week, a Celtic supporter the next. Uh, you would need to buy two scarves. My advice would also be, if you're up the Celtic end, don't have your Rangers scarf poking out your pocket. And vice versa. VK Versailles. There we are. Can everybody follow me, please? Do you support Alex Simon's party? Oh, but, well, I'm apolitical. I don't support political parties, but it'll be very interesting to see how it gets on. Can't mind you years ago on the radio, absolute legend, Masheda Tatis. That is so kind of you. How old are you, says Kelvin? Nobody knows, Kelvin. Nobody's ever been able to answer that question because I'm a time traveler, you see. So there we are, Sam and Sturgeon, both excellent politicians, very, very good first ministers. Nicola has done an outstanding job. And I think what they should have done with Alex was as soon as all the stuff was over, um, invite him to be the president of Scotland. There we are. Uh, now, what have we got? Uncle Albert, is that you? Ah, lad, dear, lad. I love your voice. Uh, the little theologian. Thank you. Henry Hall. Is that the same one that sung the teddy bear's picnic? It is your right. And can I tell you, the teddy bear's picnic used to be played if there was a fire in the theatre so that people would leave in an orderly fashion. There we are. Uh, what's your opinion on badger baiting? Would never, ever, ever countenance that. Beautiful, beautiful creatures. What do you think about roadmen? I think they do a very good job. Um, Andy Stewart, he was on TV in lunchtime in the 70s. You're right, Orinoco. Love your hat, mate. Health is wealth. So there we are, not life. Well, health is life, dear boy. Yes, <laughs> everyone's a fan of Scotty. I would hope so, Susan. You know, I mean, whether you love me or hate me, whether you like me or hate me, as long as you love me, uh, will you tell us the names of your fans? Terry, if you think I'm going to write two billion names down for you, you have another wee thing coming, Lala. There we are. But why are you still watching, Terry? Could you not find something more suited to your low IQ? 
There you are. You get you you get onto some junk. We need to scrap the TV license. What would you replace it with, though? Can I really follow me? Uh, what are you going to give the EU uh, when your oil fields are empty? Well, that won't matter because we'll all be in electric cars by then. So there we are. So we'll be giving the EU power, yes, uh, wind and wave power, whiskey, food. Remember Scotland's the larder. Yes, absolutely. Scotty, you should be made so Scotty McClure. I thank you. Can everybody follow me, please, guys? Have you ever met Andy Stewart? Yes, I knew him. knew him very well, actually. I worked with him uh, on Grampian Television. There we go. <sighs> Andy Stewart was one of the first, pardon me, Andy Stewart was one of the first students at the Royal Scottish Academy of Music and Drama School of Drama. Uh, along with John Kearney, the wonderful actor. Do you like beans? Yes, apparently they're good for the heart, and the more you eat, the more you um, enjoy them. Scotty, uh, have you had a look yet and thought about joining? A look at what? Uh, no, I haven't, Andy. No, I don't think that's for me at all. Uh, I'd have made of my cousins would wear a Celtic top and Rangers bottoms. Absolutely, yes. Uh, what are your pronouns, Darth? You never, ever, ever ask pronouns on a Scotty McClue TikTok Live. We are way beyond that. We are all inclusive. We are omni-inclusive on here. We don't need pronouns or anything like that. I love every blade of grass. I do. Uh, so there we go. Very little is needed to make a happy life. It's all within yourself, says hijab, in a way of thinking. Of course it is. I could not agree more. Absolutely topper. Hi, I was feeling down today, but seeing you has made me happy. So there we are. Thank you very much for that. Uh, up the Celtic. There we are. Up where? You know, there we are. Up the road. There we are. If we say up the Celtic or mod the hoops, we have to say we are the people. Don't ask me why. It's in the interests of balance. You're very loud. Um, yes, I think what to do is turn down your sound. Are you ever coming back? Yes, 11th hour. Thank you. I love you, says Magic. Football in Scotland is a religion. No. Football in Scotland is football. And the origins of Rangers and Celtic, they are the same religion. Absolutely identical. There might be denominational differences, but it's only one religion. And football is not a religion. Football is a sport. So there we are. Yes, if it was, they need to stop it. So there you are. How many people? Um, go along to uh, mass or divine service. Are you a fan of Matt McGinn? I thoroughly enjoy Matt McGinn. He's a character and a half. So there we are, dinky do. So we've dealt with that. You sound very posh. You go, no, 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 no. Just, uh, just uh, ordinary stuff. So there, you're all. Uh, so remember, never ever ask pronouns, guys. We're way ahead of that. Scotty the Savage is what your name should be. Brilliant. <laughs> I take pleasure in listening to C.S. Lewis due to his voice within his one recording, and we share. Do you know the little theologian? C.S. Clive Staples Lewis. Lovely, lovely man. Had a very tough time. Very sorry about what happened to Joy, the Joy Gresham. But the boys still keep in touch, kept in touch with C.S. and said he was a lovely, lovely guy. So there we are, great man, C.S. Lewis, Clive Staples Lewis. I have been compared to C.S. Lewis, they say. Scotty McClure reminds me of C.S. Lewis. He talks like a philosopher and he looks like a farmer. <laughs> there you go. You can't get much better than that. You can't, theologian. Scotty, an absolute belter. Thanks for speaking the truth and making my day. Ian, it's been a privilege and a pleasure. I'm just about to push off. Uh, so there we are. Now, Nathan, 
What you need to go is just have a real think, is that the very, very best quality that you can come out with? Remember, you're on TikTok's top talk show. And that's really all you can think of. That's the level that you, Nathan, operate at. Is that what you're telling us? Go and have a serious think. I won't give you a lifetime ban because I think there might be a way back for you. But sitting there, writing that kind of stuff on my TikTok, no, 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 no. All right, Nathan, go and grow up some. <clears throat> there we go. Now, what have we got here? Have you ever had a buttery or a rowy? Oh, when I was in Aberdeen, I had butteries and rowies all oh, day. Loved them. And then a softy in the morning and ah. Some people like the rowies crisp. Hello, sir. Good evening. Watching from the Philippines, Jimmy. We love the Philippines. We send you love. There we go. Guys, can you all follow me, please? Hello from Glasgow in Kentucky. Jeffrey, welcome, welcome, welcome. Lovely to have you with us. You from Glasgow, Jung. I from Glasgow. Hey from Brazil. You're still like a narrator. How's your voice like that, says you? I don't know. It's just my voice. Uh, C.S. Lewis, wonderful man, says Buttery. Yes, Glasgow, Kentucky, fantastic. Lovely C.S. Lewis statue in Belfast. Lovely gem, right? A wonderful, wonderful man. C.S. Lewis, and I'll tell you another wonderful man, um, well respected in Ireland, Gerard Manley Hopkins. So have a look at him as well. So there we are. Now, who have we got? Oh, very, very nice. Yes, I'm being offered food here. So there we are. M. Random, you need to go and just grow up. Half wit. Right, he's gone. What an idiot. We troll there. <laughs> so, uh, say hello to Luke. He's getting a haircut after lockdown. Thank you, sir. Love the Philippines. So there we are. Hello from Norwich. Love to Norwich and Norfolk, I say. Guys, can you all follow me, please? We're very, very, very short of followers, but we have thousands upon thousands of viewers to the Scotty McClue pop-ups on TikTok. So there we are. There's, um, here we go. Hello, I'm back, says person. Hello, person. Lovely to have you with us. Guys, remember, if you're just a wee troll, you'll just get fired into space. Long sausage or square sausage? Hello from Aberdeen. So there we are. Um, I think uh, both, I enjoy both. Both a lawn and a square slice on my roll. So there we are. Jesus Christ, the Lord and Savior, is coming soon. Wagwan. I think you have a very good point, sir. Yes, I hope he gets here real soon. I love it here, says Magic. Magic, it's so lovely to have you with us. And dinky-doo, I say. There you are. Welcome to Scotty McClue. Guys, I'll maybe play you a wee tune on the organ since it's Sunday. So there we are. Here we go. Are we ready? Right. Now you'll like this. We tune on the pipe organ for every day for Sunday, and uh, and then and then we'll have one for Palm Sunday for all the Christians watching. How are you, kids? Says Nathan. So there we go. What's your opinions on vegans? I have a feeling they produce more methane than non-vegans. Are we ready? Right. There we are.
Do you like that, guys? What about this one now for Pam Sunday? Did you like that one? Wonderful stuff. A wee bit of a song for you there. Now, who have we got? Get the squeeze box out. So there we are. Celtic Rangers. Go and see them both play. Make up your mind. That's always the best thing to do, I would say. Fantastic. Aye, aye, Scotty. So there we go. Love your playing, King. Sounds familiar. Very beautiful. Thank you, XZ. Very, very kind of you. Amazing. Love it. Amazing. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, love it. Says 60 Rossi. Rossi, thank you so much. Very, very kind of you. Now, guys, it's time I wasn't here. Thank you so much for your beautiful company this afternoon. Please follow me. Remember, you can... Hello from our mayor, Scotty. Remember, you can get on to Scotty McClue's YouTube channel directly from TikTok. Go on, watch all the videos. There's 1,264 of them, I think. And uh, you'll get a right laugh. So there you are. Wonderful stuff. Um, Ag is asking, why are you crying? Well, it's just very, very moving to have so many beautiful people on the one TikTok at the one time. And we're live. Please follow me. Remember, follow, follow, follow. We're very short on followers. We have a huge number of viewers, thousands. But for some reason, only a few do the actual following. Now, I don't think it's a lot to ask. You know what I mean? So please do follow and uh, we'll get sorted out. Bless you, so it's empty, not at all. So there you are. Where do you live? I live on the planet. It's wonderful stuff. Everybody, please follow. If you haven't followed, please follow. I can see if you follow me here and it would be so much appreciated. Follow, follow, follow. And like all the YouTubes. That would be wonderful. Right, guys, I'm going to have to push off. But uh, stay fabulous, stay safe, look after your dear selves, and we'll do some more live pop-ups during the week. Uh, you know, early evening's a good time, and uh, mid-evening, 8 o'clock, half 8, 9 o'clock, that sort of stuff. We're on the planet, Scotland or Wales. I'm in Scotland at the moment. Do you like music? I love music. I absolutely love it, and I hope you liked the playing. Right, there we are. Fantastic. Catch up soon, guys. I'll sing you the goodbye song. Are we ready? Much love. Thank you very much. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. Au revoir. Au revoir. And the cheery oh. Take care of yourself. See you guys. Ta la las. And from Scotty McClure, dinky doo to every one of you.